Jam is the international competition for genetically engineering machines. And this, I think, is a very great competition to engage young people, even high school students, into uh, yeah, synthetic biology. They get the chance to uh, make uh, yeah, their own organism and a new uh, functionality. So uh, iGEM also has a nice uh, cloning standard which helps uh, to make this uh, uh, happen in a short time. Cloning in synthetic biology and especially in the context of iGEM we're talking about combining two or three genes coming from different organisms, putting them together and therefore generating a new organism that can do something it couldn't do before. In normal engineering uh, standards have been around for a while and this really helps to build complex things like uh, a computer is built up of all small parts that behave exactly as expected yeah, because they are produced to a certain standard. And the problem with biology often is that yeah, it's very hard to predict and very hard to understand what every part, a part is doing because it gets very complex. So if you make a standard and uh, you know how parts behave, then you can build complex things, right? I myself also well, was introduced into the field of synthetic biology through this competition. I think what it really does nicely is to uh, introduce a standard for cloning, for instance. Also, it shows you then also the limitations of these kind of systems and, and why it's important to have standardization. I really think that uh, iGEM can help to motivate or to uh, get people involved in synthetic biology.